The next pose that we are going to teach you is the Supta Parisrata Padhastasan. Seated, wide angle, forward bend. In this pose, we are going to open our pelvic area. We are going to make the pelvic area really flexible. And this is what's going to help us at the time of labor and childbirth. So let's begin. So all you'll need again is a few bolsters and the cushions. You're going to just separate your legs more as wide as you can get. Make them up, separate them apart as wide as you can. Now, if you feel that your spine is hanging back or forth, forward, you just take a cushion and place it behind your hip so that your back is upright. For many, you will not be able to stretch so much because you'll have a tight hamstring or a tight um, thigh muscles. So the best is then you can bend your knee slightly. You can bend your knee slightly. It's okay to bend your knee. Yeah. And place a cushion underneath. Yeah. Taking a few deep breaths, you're going to inhale, raise both your arms up, creating length in the spine. And exhale, come forward. Make sure that you come forward from the hip. The belly is not to be compressed. Go down as far as you can working on those legs. Toes are wide open. Bend your elbows if you have to on the floor. And just simply surrender. Keep that length of the spine. And deep breathing which will nourish. The breath is going to nourish the baby. It's going to send important oxygen into the abdomen so deep the abdominal chest breathing hold this pose as long as you can at a comfortable stretch and when you're going to come up all you're going to do is just walk your back, palms back slowly bend your knees slightly and just stretch your legs forward sit in a comfortable cross-legged position and Again, once again, stay focused to your breath. Even if you can't come forward, if you just sit with your legs apart against the wall, the benefit of the posture will all be there in the body. <music>